I was diagnosed back in 2013 with a prostate cancer. I had been seeing my general practitioner on an annual basis, and at some point he suggested that I also begin to see a urologist. The first evidence is through what is called the PSA exam, and subsequently I, I had a biopsy, which established that there was a, a cancer there. Almost all of us, when we first hear the C word, there's a little bit of shock, some anxiety. But I had been in ESCA for several years. Many of the volunteers in ESCA join after they've had an experience with cancer. Mine occurred after I was already a member. But I think there's something that's somewhat unique about prostate cancer. Because there is a sexual connotation Following surgery, there's often the problem of urinary incontinence. My experience with men who have had prostate cancer suggests to me that they just feel uncomfortable talking about something which they consider to be highly personal. Interestingly enough, I had observed that, and when my prostate cancer was diagnosed, I said, no, uh, I'm going to put it all out there. Uh, I'm prepared to talk about it. And I think I was influenced by the women in ESCA because I noticed that they had no difficulty talking about their experience, for instance, with breast cancer. So I said to myself, well, why should it be any different with men?